Welcome back. Hello. How are you feeling? Don't worry, it's okay. I don't remember either. Over there. It's dry, isn't it? We can go slowly. I am here with you. Just a bit farther. We're all right. Spring will slake our thirst. It seems everyone, everywhere, is thirsty. There is a spring that will cure that thirst. One that weeps tears of blood. That's what they said, anyway. This way. So, it is you. <laughs> Here, this is for you. A new spring and a fresh source of labor. Ha <laughs> We really hit the jackpot. Get up. It's time for a bit of fun. On your feet! For a 
about to go hunt for blood beads. Hurry up and get ready. You're awake then? Whoa, keep it down. Your friend just fell asleep. So, what happened to your masks? Forgotten about those too, have you? I'll tell you whatever you want to know, but first, go back there and put on a purifier mask. Looks like the folks upstairs want you. Well, they can wait, can't they? More importantly, that mask suits you. Without those things, we Revenants will join the ranks of the Lost in a flash. So be careful. So, what do you want to know? According to the folks up there, it's a place to keep laborers who gather blood beads. More concisely, it's a slave pen. A human that died but got kicked awake again. That's what you are. A revenant. As long as your heart is intact, you'll keep coming back. But you have to drink blood and you'll become one of the lost. It's ironic. Creatures made to fight the horrors of the Great Collapse now have to fight their own fallen kin. Each time we die, we lose some part of our memory, be it big or small. It's usually nothing important, and you don't even notice you've forgotten. Well, your case is a little rare, I guess. Lost are revenants who have succumbed to bloodthirst and turned into real life monsters. If our heart is destroyed, we turn to ash. But the lost don't care if they're left with no heart. Still, it takes them a while to come back, which makes them like us revenants. The air in this place is something in it that speeds up the bloodthirst. We call it miasma. The mask? Helps filter it out. Missile purifies the air nearby, but it's been drying up lately, just like the blood springs. Be careful where you take off your mask, unless you want to join the lost. If we revenants don't drink human blood, we join the lost. But humans are scarce after the great collapse and all. Folks like us don't get blood, but there's something we can use in its place. Blood beads. I don't know why such a lucky thing came along, but they started appearing after the Queen frenzied and was taken down. There are some who believe that there are tears, but it doesn't matter much to us where they come from. Missile is a sort of plant that purifies miasma and renders it safe. It's one of the successes of Project Queen. Even if it withers, it can be brought back with medicine made from the Queen's blood. But there's no hope of that now. If activated missile turned up somewhere, it'd be a big help in exploration. sleep. Let her sleep. She wore herself out watching over you.
you're going to kill me too? Anything for a kick, right? Just don't crush my heart. Stop already. My body may still be alive, but my soul died long ago. No one could stay sane after dying again and again and again and again. Don't take my memories. My family. I have nothing left. There's no way we're gonna find blood beads. The missile's all dried up and the miasma keeps getting thicker. Telling us to look for blood beads here is just crazy. Wandering, they say, the folks up there. They might live in safety. But because of their levy, we have to risk our necks to collect blood beads. Just you wait. One day, I'm gonna make thralls out of a whole lot. view never improves, does it? He came back home after the war against the Queen and found this mist. Getting close to it causes enough pain to drive you mad, so no one has ever crossed it. There's nowhere to go home to, even outside of this prison. <laughs> <laughs> 